Hello students, how are you? We have question 59. Actually, we have 59 and 60, basically the same question, the same solution, but you'll see uh, the difference between them. Uh, here they say, in the opposite circuit, what is the reading of the emitter in the two cases? Okay, I have when the switch is open and when the switch is closed. Okay, we notice here in this circuit that uh, 3 ohm and 3 ohm, they are connected in series with the battery, right? They are on the same line. We are talking when the switch is open, okay? So... Uh, the, uh, the emitter reading, I need I equals to uh, V by R. V is 6 and R is the total of 3 and 3. Since they are in series, we add them. So we say 6 by 3 plus 3 is going to be 1. Ampere, of course. Okay? So when the switch is open, it's one. It's either here or here. Okay, so we can cancel C and D. Okay, now let's discuss when, before I change, I will erase, when the switch is closed. When the switch is closed. Okay? Okay, let's go. Uh, remember I told you before, if I have a wire inside a circuit that is empty, it has nothing, we deal with it as it doesn't exist, okay, because it doesn't make any difference. The same idea here, the current will go out of the positive of the battery through the emitter into the first resistor in here, it will complete in here the same current and it will go back to the battery again okay like this one doesn't exist okay so basically I will have the same connection 3 and 3 are in series so I'm going to do the same steps here so I will get again the current is 1 ampere when the switch is closed so we go here so the correct answer is A okay uh, this question is repeated in number 60. You see here, the same drawing. They say, study the opposite circuit. If the reading of the ammeter when the switch is open, it was I. Okay? What is the reading when the switch is closed? They say, like, what difference does it make when we close the switch? Okay? So, we know from the previous uh, question is going to be the same as when it is open, okay? So, before it was I, now it's going to be the same because as I told you in here, it's like it doesn't exist because it doesn't contain anything, so nothing. So, the this, this same current will still flow through the first and second resistors, both of them, okay? and go back to the battery. So the answer is I. If they tell you it was uh, 3, how is going to be when the switch is closed? You go directly to 3. Okay, so the current is going to be the same, whatever the value is. Okay, so uh, these are the questions, 59 and 60. If you have any question, please uh, leave it under the video. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.